I'm Alex with Storyline Travel. At Storyline Travel, we're premier travel specialists, helping you create memorable experiences through travel. This is one of my favorite videos, as we're going to talk about complimentary dining on the Celebrity Apex. Thank you for joining us. As we stepped aboard the Celebrity Apex, we learned that this ship offers not one, but four different main dining rooms. And this beautiful compass spans the two decks that stands as the hub of your main dining restaurants. Let's begin with the Cosmopolitan restaurant. This sparkling dining room offers an American style food with global influences. The Cosmopolitan not only offers great evening dining options, but we found this was the primary restaurant used to serve breakfast and have lunch options during our cruise. While all four main dining rooms will offer a similar set of choices of classic starters and classic entrees, each restaurant will proudly boast a set of exclusives available only to that specific restaurant. Our family enjoyed the salmon garblox and the pan seared cod, while for dessert we enjoyed a delicious carrot cake. The lunch menu offers some lighter fare options such as bolognese skewer and seafood brochette. Breakfast was varied from continental breakfast like yogurt and fruits to bagels and lox. Now let's head over to the Cyprus restaurants which showcases Greek heritage with a beautiful dining room and sensational Mediterranean fare. At Cyprus we really enjoyed the breadsticks and enjoyed the Mediterranean flair of the Greek mezzi board, the hot melted cheese saganaki, the Greek style slow braised lamb shank, and we even enjoyed the signature dessert of a baked Alaska. As you can see my Greek's not that good but the food was outstanding. The third restaurant we'll talk about is Normandy. As you can imagine with this name, the restaurant is themed around more of a French flair and its dedicated menu items spoke to that French elegant style. We enjoyed starters like baked brie, entrees, beef tenderloin and croté, and of course a nice opera cake for dessert. It really made for an elegant meal each night that we dined in this fantastic restaurant. And finally, let's talk about the Tuscan restaurant, a modern design inspired by Italy. Come to dinner and enjoy Italian style dishes with a rustic flair. We enjoyed dishes on the menu, such as Tuscan shrimp soup and a signature steak, Diane. And Strozopati Cabanara. We were actually fortunate enough to be sailing in February and on Valentine's Day we were in Tuscan in which the ladies in our traveling party enjoyed receiving a beautiful rose. Beyond the main dining room, let's visit a few places around the ship where you can grab a bite to eat that is also complimentary. For example, heading over to Eden and enjoying a meal in a beautiful garden setting. Eden is located on the back part of the ship in an area that is also used for entertainment, but for breakfast and lunch they do have a small dining room that offers some wonderful salads and sandwich as their base offering. For breakfast you'll find breakfast paninis, pastries, you'll find hot tea and coffee and they were absolutely wonderful. The lunch is more of a healthy menu where you will find pre-made or build your own salad with potato salad and bread and fruit. In addition, you'll find sandwiches. And again, this is more of a lighter fare here in Eden. If you're looking for even more healthy options, the Spa Cafe is a great place to find juices, smoothies, and entrees like avocado brochettes. But sometimes you've got that simple craving for a burger and fries. 
Slide up to the mass grill and place your order. Burgers, hot dogs, and french fries are a staple of this fun destination to eat. Now, let's head over to the Ocean View Cafe. Beginning with your welcome aboard dessert, this buffet-style restaurant offers a lot of creative, delicious, and visibly enjoyable options. Multiple drink stations include juice, tea, both hot and cold, as well as regular and decaf coffee. The buffet is actually set up with many food stations. Browse around and find the fare that speaks to you. We always like to look for the Indian food to see if today's the day they're going to serve a family favorite, butter chicken. We also enjoy the stir fry and the special attention that is given when our food is prepared. Evenings feature international themes such as an English night, which will come complete with fish and chips. Check out the bakery. You might get a chance to see something being prepared. Here we've got a glimpse of the Kringles being created for the next day's buffet. Desserts delight here in the Ocean View Cafe. For example, a chocolate shawarma. This beautiful chocolate log of multiple types of chocolate was shaved for the topping on delicious crepes filled with your choice of berries and fillings. Since we were sailing during Valentine's Day, the chefs went all out to create some stunning cakes to celebrate this sweet holiday. You will find afternoon tea set up here in the cafe where there was plenty of seating and everyone can enjoy a nice midday treat. In the very back of the cafe, you'll find the pizzeria offering classic cheese and pe pepperoni pizzas each day and they threw in a third specialty pizza. Stop by to see what is being offered each day. Ice cream for ice cream at Scoops. Located near the entrance of the Ocean View Cafe, this cool spot offers a variety of ice creams during the afternoon and it was a quick run in and run out from the pool deck. Now I'd like to focus on a few dining areas that are included with some fares so you could say they were complimentary to the particular cabin class but they weren't open to all guests. First, let's start with Aqua Class guests. Guests that had booked Aqua Class staterooms were given the ability to eat at the Blue Restaurant. Blue offers a fresh and bold dining option with really clean, crisp flavors. This is a exclusive restaurant and is only available to guests that have booked in those rooms. Additionally, for sweet guests, they have the retreat and one of the dining venues in the retreat is Lumine. This formal dining room is available only to suite guests. It is a stunning and beautiful dining room offering a exclusive private dining experience with a menu that changes daily but is aligned more with those main dining rooms that we discussed earlier. So if you want that more exclusive feel, um, you want less crowds, uh, when you're you're dining and the more attention you get from just having uh, a few servers who really get to know you staying in the retreat and enjoying uh, dinner at Lumine is really for you so did we make you hungry give us a, a comment below tell us which dining room uh, spoke to you which one you think you would enjoy visiting most and when you're ready to book that cruise on Celebrity, give Storyline Travel a call. We'd love to help you book your next cruise. And at Storyline Travel, we believe every adventure is a story waiting to be told.